गुड आफ्टरनून एवरी वन टूडे आई हैव स्टार्टेड टू कोर्सेस राइट सो डोंट वरी इवन द इंग्लिश कोर्स वीडियो विल कम दैट बाय लिंग्वेल द हिंदी प्लस इंग्लिश दैट लेक्चर नंबर सिक्सटी इज गोइंग ऑन सो दैट इज ऑल्सो गोइंग टू कम बट नाउ राइट नाउ आई एम लॉन्चिंग द इंग्लिश कोर्स ऑल्सो फॉर फिजिक्स ऑप्शनल बिकॉज सम साउथ इंडियन एंड नॉर्थ ईस्टर्न पीपल some students were uh, very uh, they could not understand hindi so that's why i am launching the course in english also and uh, one person uh, from maharashtra was uh, not able to understand properly in hindi so i have launched marathi from him, for him theek uh, hai okay so uh, for him marathi course has course has been launched and this course will be in complete english okay not uh, bilingual uh, not mixing of language okay this is in complete english okay so you will have to see this okay so uh, let's uh, start our lecture number 1 not lecture number 1 this is basically orientation so orientation uh, we can say about orientation that uh, so some people are confused about their optional so they ask uh, that how is physics optional in upsc is it beneficial or not and uh, some frequently asked questions are there right so see uh why physics optional in upsc if you go to delhi in upsc uh, optionals such as uh, upsc not uh, okay in upsc optional such as uh, uh, these are very common what psir and uh, history optional type Yeah, humanities optionals are very common in Delhi. Okay, so uh, in this uh, scenario, the physics optional seems to be very odd to some people. Okay, they feel that uh, why to take science optional in UPSC? Why to burden ourselves too much? You are wrong, my friend. You won't be burdened. See, physics optional is uh, in fact uh, very much, very much more beneficial. Uh, then your uh, humanities optionals because in humanities optional you have to always care about ideology you have you have to always uh, take the most uh, sensitive issues in a very calculated manner you have to write okay like uh, in history optional the question regarding origin of aryans has come again and again okay so uh, in history optional as the uh, question regarding origin of aryans has come again and again in the pyq so uh, when students try to write it there are basically three view points about the origin of aryans okay those three view points are that they are indigenous people they are not indigenous people and they are a combination of indigenous and migrated people okay so in this scenario if a student writes uh, history optional answers he will have to take a very balanced approach and this balanced approach will require too much practice okay it will require too much practice okay but uh, uh, similarly in psir optional also one question was asked that uh, you know already that uh, uh, regarding 2019 lok sabha elections psir optional person uh, had asked one question that uh, uh, how caste and religion have played a role in recent 2019 lok sabha elections the question uh, ran like that okay so in this regard in this question also uh, you will have to uh, take very uh, balanced approach and calculated language and uh, and etc etc many ifs and buts are there like uh, you cannot take a favor of any particular political party okay you will have to uh, the manage the language in such a way that even even a minor criticism looks very uh, it looks even if you criticize someone in humanities paper you will have to uh, use such a such a language the beauty of language should be should be such that it should not hurt the person who is uh, checking the answer sheets right so in, in this I, these are the limitations of humanities optionals theek hai uh, no sorry okay so uh, history and psr optional are like that and uh, many more optionals are there but uh, you will have to uh, take physics optional if your science is good okay you should take it then 
you should take it for sure if your science field was good since the childhood you were a uh, okay okay person in science not a very dull student uh, some people uh, uh, take physics optional who were a failure in physics university paper don't do that okay you should be a little bit you know physics knowing person you should not be completely dumbo okay you should be little bit physics knowing person and uh, even if you you have used to score 40 percent 50 percent marks in your uh, physics papers in university you are in but only only such persons are not allowed to take physics optional who always used to fail in physics right from the childhood okay those persons should not take physics optional others all can take physics optional whosoever has studied physics in their graduation okay so this is the physics optional and the perks associated with this optional are that it is uh, it is a very uh, not current affairs and it is not dynamic it is highly static okay no current affairs needed it is highly static subject okay so if you solve the question papers right from 1991 if you start the question paper solving from 1991 and solve the question paper till 2021 uh like uh, you just mug up all the steps uh, like a perfect uh, 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 <laughs> what we can say that rot learning what uh, you we used to do in the school days so from the 1991 to 2021 the question papers of physics optional if you solve them by rot learning and uh, 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 along with this i will tell the book name of books those books you will have to follow and after when you follow those books you will have to do the solved examples from there okay so if if you do only this much okay nothing uh, nothing else required only this much 1991 to 2021 question papers of physics optional and along with that you will have to uh, do uh, this also what we can say uh, the solved examples from some specific books the list which i am going to tell you okay if you do only this much okay no one is going to stop you from scoring 290 plus in physics okay got it so uh, be ready for the uh, this uh, this course has been specially launched for south indian and north eastern people okay this question uh, this course is specially for south indian and north eastern people okay uh, along with this uh, lecture number 60 of english course okay english course uh, lecture number 60 is also going to come in 2 uh, hours okay so stay tuned for that also okay thank you very much